morning, kids. I hope you are having a great day. Today, we are going to talk something that is full of fun and entertaining, and it's called celebrations. What are the things that we celebrate, and why do we celebrate them? Now, to learn more about the importance of these celebrations, let's watch and listen to the video that we will be presenting. Kids, what comes to your mind if you hear the word celebrations? You might be thinking of the following. A birthday party, graduation day, a wedding day. And you are right. This event has something to do with celebrations. But wait, what are celebrations? Well, celebrations are happy and enjoyable events or ceremonies that brings people together to give thanks, to show appreciation, to pay respect, to honor, and to remember something that is very, very important. Here are some of the celebrations that we have in Thailand. The Waikru Day. The Waikru Day is usually conducted on the first day or beginning of classes, which is usually in the month of June. During Waikru Day, students prepare traditional flower trays to give to their teachers. They kneel and bow down to say thank you and to show respect to their teachers. We also celebrate the National Father's Day on the 5th of December, which is also the birthday of His Majesty King, King Bomibol. During Father's Day, people show their respect to the King by offering the canna lily flower, which is also the symbol of Father's Day in Thailand. It is also expected of children to do exceptionally good things towards their fathers during this day. Mother's Day is also celebrated in Thailand, and this is on August 12th, which is also Her Majesty Queen, Queen Sirikit's birthday. Queen Sirikit is also considered as the mother of all Thai people. The jasmine flower is the flower of Mother's Day in Thailand. It is said to be the symbol of Mother's pure love. During this celebration, kids kneel before their mothers and present them the jasmine flower to show their love and to say thank you for their mother's unconditional love. Remember kids, August 12 is Mother's Day. And it is also the birthday of Her Majesty Queen, Queen Sirikit. Our beloved King and Queen. Our beloved King and Queen have royal charities. They do good deeds towards other people, especially those who are in need, like the poor and sick people. Can you also do good deeds to support royal charities? Yes, you can. Cleaning your surroundings, helping to plant trees are a good start. Do you know who this man is? He is King Chulalongkorn or King Rama V. He is a great king. He has done a lot of good deeds towards the people of Thailand. He is the grandfather of King Bumibol and great-grandfather of King Maha Vajilalongkorn. Chulalongkorn Day is celebrated on the 23rd day of October. A reed laying ceremony in front of the statue of King Rama V is conducted to pay respect 
and to express allegiance to the king. Remember, Cholalongkorn Day is on October 23. Religious celebrations is also observed in Thailand, and these are the holidays in Buddhism. The Makabuchi Day, also known as the Buddhist All Saints Day, is celebrated on the full moon day of the third lunar month. Alms giving, listening to Buddhist teachings, praying, and parade of lighted candles are some of the activities during this celebration. The Visakha Bucha Day is a celebration that commemorates the three major events in the life of Buddha, his birth, his enlightenment, and his death. This is celebrated on the full moon day of the sixth lunar month. Visiting temples, joining processions or parade are among the activities during Visakha Bucha Day. Asana Bucha Day takes place on the full moon day of the eighth lunar month. This marks the day when Buddha delivered his first sermon to his disciples. Remember kids that during the holidays in Buddhism, people are expected to make merit, meaning they have to do good deeds towards other people. I hope you learned something today. Until our next video clip. Good day kids. I hope you did have fun answering the activities and listening to the videos. Next time, kids, we will do more fun and entertaining activities. But this time, I want you to take a photo of the activities that you answered and send it back to teacher. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.